SAT prep, here we go. This is my guy, Steve. Solve for x. Okay, so the square root of 3x plus 4 plus 2 equals x. So here, subtracting 2, we get that's the square root of 3x plus 4 equals x minus 2. And now to get rid of that radical, raise both sides to some power. If we square this left-hand side, we get just 3x plus 4. So we're squaring the right-hand side, meaning we have to multiply this out. 4 will it out, right? So that's x minus 2 times itself. Okay, so I'll find that out. We get 3x plus 4 equals x squared minus 4x plus 4. Now it's a quadratic equation. So uh, subtracting 3x, subtracting 4, we get 0 equals x squared. Subtracting 3x, we get minus 7x. Subtracting 4, the 4s go away. Now we factor the other side. Well, both of them have an x in common. So taking an x off of each, so that's x times x minus 7. So x equals 0, there's one of our solutions, and x minus 7 equals 0. And that would be our two solutions to the equation. However, because it's a radical equation, because there's a square root involved, we know we have to uh, check the answers because extraneous solutions can occur. So checking x equals 0, we'd say, okay, that's the square root of 3 times 0 plus 4 plus 2 is that equal to zero? So that's the square root of four plus two. Is that equal to zero? Now, this square root does not have a plus or minus in front. So that's the principal square root, the positive square root, meaning the positive square root of four is two plus two. Is that equal to zero? It's just not, right? Four does not equal zero. Meaning x equals zero is not a solution to this equation, okay? So if we check seven, we say, okay, well, that's the square root of three times seven plus four plus two. Is that equal to seven? Well, so the square root of 25 plus 2. Is that equal to 7? Again, this is the principal square root, the positive square root. So the positive square root of 25 is 5 plus 2. Is that equal to 7? Yep, 7 equals 7. All my life, that's been true. Yep, yep, yep. So in other words, 7 is a solution to this equation, okay? Whereas 0 is not a solution. In this case, it would be an extraneous solution. Always remember, math is everywhere.